Hello, this is the Hot Tub Professor, and what we're going to talk about today is air valves. This is a valve that you see on top of your tub. If you open it, you can see there's a little pintle right here that opens up. If you open it, it allows air to be pulled through a jet, and it actually makes the jet stronger. So when you go through it, what it happens is a jet works off of a Venturi style. So in most jets, what you have is a water side like this, and then you have an air side. This actually hooks to the little 3 8 barb that's on the air side. And the idea is, is when you force water through it at a high rate of speed, it creates a suction right here. If you allow it to have air, then it will force air through the jet, and it makes it a more vigorous type massage. It's more like this instead of straight jet. And that's what the purpose of the air valve is. So simply the only moving part in the system is this valve. If that valve is open, it allows it to have air. When it closes, it stops it from having air. And it's just that simple. So a couple of things. If you're having water come out here, then that's a problem. That's not the valve that's causing that. Usually it's going to be what we call a crossover. That means a jet is out of the body or there's something causing the water pressure to cross in the back here and go out the airline. And what it does is goes out the airline. The airline will be like that. It goes through the manifold and it goes up here and the water comes out. There's no air pressure here or water pressure. It is suction only. So when this opens, this is suction. So it's just that simple. So if you come closer, I'll show you how the uh, system works. It's basically just like this right here. If you open this valve right here, it draws air through. The air goes down into a manifold, and the manifold can even be glued directly onto here. Sometimes you'll see this kind of scenario where the manifold's glued like that, and that's all there is. So if it's like this, you open it, and it allows air to be drawn through here, through the tubes, and all these tubes will go to all the different jet bodies. This is a jet body. So the pump pulls water in, the water goes here, the water goes in here, goes out the jet into the tub, creates a suction here, and it's creating a suction. You open this up, it allows air to be pulled through here, and it makes it more vigorous. It's just that simple. If you close it, then there's still suction here, but it's not allowed to pull any air. So the other thing is, is if you have a situation where you close the valve and it doesn't stop the air from coming through the system, then what you've got is a, the valve is probably bad. It has a, uh, it has rubber inside here that will lose its seal. You can also get broken parts inside of it. If you open them up, uh, sometimes this one uh, will, the little part that holds the handle on will break off on this particular style and this will not seal, or you could have a crack in the manifold from freeze damage. There's all kinds of things that you could have wrong. So remember, if you've got water coming out here, that's not how this uh, fails. There's water coming out, this is not the problem. Don't order this, it will not fix it. If you've got uh, water coming out of an air valve, then you've got a problem with a jet crossing over or some, something of that nature. If you have a situation where you're opening this and it doesn't make any difference, then it could be uh, that this has come unhooked, or it could be that this is no longer opening, something's broken, or if you can't cut the air off, something could be broken, or a part of the system could be open. The other thing is if this is bad and you have to replace the entire thing, sometimes you're going to find them that you can't get parts for, you have to replace the whole thing. And the way it mounts is there's a, about a, this particular one is about a one and five eighths, uh, yeah, one and five eighths hole. It goes down in the hot tub. It's got a little rubber seal right here. It seals. You stick this in here and tighten it up against the hot tub, and that's all you see on the hot tub. And then if this part was glued directly into it, same thing. Doesn't do you any good to buy the valve. You got to have this too, if that's what's under it. Uh, if you're real lucky, you'll have this, a piece of soft pipe, and you can just cut it off and couple it back together. So check us out today. We have air valves in all different brands. And if you're having to replace a whole air valve, it doesn't matter if it looks exactly like what you have. They're all basically the same, do the same operation. This does the exact same thing, works off the same principle. If you open it like this, it allows air to be drawn through. If you close it, it stops it. And most of them have one inch uh, inlets on the bottom, so it basically grooves to one inch pipe, just like that. So check us out today. I'm the hot, I'm the hot tub professor. And this is American Spot Parts.